Sometimes, all it takes to get things started is to break away from the norm. Get your favorite snack from Jack's and just see where that takes your day. Jack's is the place for burgers, fries, shakes and more. It's feel good food at a great price. So step away from the ordinary and add a twist. Head to Jack's, cause Jack's keeps you moving. Hey, it's Jay Barker from The Opening Drive, here to give you Alabama's keys to victory this weekend against the Florida Gators. I know a lot of you are excited about this game. We get them in regular season. Hopefully we get them once again in the SEC title game. Florida last week found some offense, and a guy named Trey Burton, number eight, be watching for him. He'll be a key part of their offense. Alabama's got to contain him, stop him. More importantly, get a rush on a guy named John Brantley. A lot of you have heard about this uh, guy backing up Tim Tebow over the last few years. Got an outstanding arm, really got a great mind for the game. Had some issues with their snaps early in the season that kind of took his timing away in the passing game, but it's something that they've really been working hard on in practice, and he seems to be getting better each and every week uh, with their offense. And so many playmakers out there. Alabama's defense, I think the biggest thing we saw this past week against Arkansas, the defensive backs got tested, and I think Urban Meyer is going to come out with formations, movements, and shifts and really try to confuse the young secondary. I think also Alabama's linebacker core has got to be more involved. They're talking about switching up some guys in different positions to get more pressure to the outside, especially with the jet action that you're going to get with the running backs as they give the ball off and the guy gets some of the quick sweeps. Alabama's got to be able to contain those type of things. So Florida's going to throw a lot of them defensively. We'll see whether or not Alabama can respond. I think they can get the job done. Offensively, establish the run and also open up the run with the pass like they have done in recent years. Alabama's uh, done a great job in the last few weeks as far as putting up some big numbers. But I think it's key to keep that Florida offense off the field. So sustained drives, dominating the line of scrimmage on both sides of the football. And again, having that physical presence that they had back in the SEC championship game last year where they really came and just hit Florida in the mouth and were able to dominate them for 60 minutes. So that's the keys to the victory. I think Alabama gets it done again for the 2010 season, this regular season game against the Florida Gators coming up this Saturday at 7 p.m. on CBS.